In this video I'm going to demonstrate taking apart a hard drive to harvest the neodymium magnets that are inside. Each hard drive should have two of these magnets and I'll show you my magnet monstrosity I've got right here from other hard drives. Ugh. All right, so let's start. You will need some torque screwdrivers or torque bits. This little kit here was about six bucks and it has T5 through T9. The most common ones I've seen are usually T6 or T8. There's a few really old hard drives that have Phillips heads on them, but the majority of them that I've encountered are always torque bit. Getting started, I'm gonna remove the six screws all around the drive here. This is a 40 gigabyte Western Digital IDE hard drive. Okay, six screws are out, but the cover's not going to come off. There's always one, sometimes two, hidden screws under the label. They're usually up here towards the round section where the platter is. You can feel around with your finger. There it is right there. Well, this one has another one. Back here. Fair enough. Now the cover comes off. Okay, at this point the magnets are just right here. We're going to take a few of these other screws and pieces off to get the magnets out. There are also screws that are holding the hard drive platter on. The method for taking these apart is pretty much the same, but I mean there can be differences depending on the manufacturer. Some may have extra screws or that sort of thing. All right, platter's out, and that just lifts off. And there's the magnets right there. And this is actually just one piece. In most of the drives, you got two separate magnets like this, and they're also bigger than what I just pulled out of that one. Those are little bitty rinky-dink ones. These are very strong. Careful not to get your fingers in between there, but they're also fun to play with. Turn around this way. Okay, well that is how you harvest the neodymium magnets from a hard drive. Hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.